Welcome back in. Ellie Watson joining us now to talk about getting our hands on some spring and summer veggies and through some local farmer markets as well. How are you doing? Doing well. Happy to be here. Good, good, good. So you are with uh, Sweet Grown Alabama. Tell us what this is. Absolutely. So Sweet Grown Alabama is our state's nonprofit agricultural branding program. We encourage consumers across Alabama to support Alabama farmers. Mm -hmm. We have an online database at sweetgrownalabama.org where consumers can find these fantastic locally grown products all across our state. Yeah, you're talking about farmers markets there, right? So t uh, what, tell us about those. So farmers markets are one of the best places to find an abundance of local products. You can find not only produce like we have here grown right in Alabama, but also meat products, mm -hmm. fresh cut flowers, jams and jellies, peanuts, all kinds of locally grown products in a one stop shop. So many of our farmers markets are open year round, but right now is the time for our spring farmers markets and our warm season crops to come in and our farmers to start harvesting those. So it's a great time to get out and visit those local markets. Yeah, so we were showing some pictures of some of that right there of some of those farmer markets, but you've got some in studio. Uh, kind of pull some out, show us out. Where did they come from? Absolutely, really? absolutely. So these squash and zucchini and collards mm -hmm. are down from Baldwin County. We were at a conference at the beach and got to enjoy some of their early produce this week. You said that because it's warmer there, Yes, right? it's a little warmer mm -hmm. there. So our Central Alabama, North Alabama friends will get to experience this goodness in the coming weeks. Mm -hmm. Then we also have strawberries which are ready and abundant across the state of Alabama. So you can visit our you pick strawberries or go buy a gallon from a farmer that already has those picked pretty much anywhere in the state of Alabama right now. Yeah, and I got to tell you, I can smell the strawberries <laughs> from here. The freshness of them, they really have a little bit more smell to them and stuff like that. Why is it so important for us? to support the local farmers? The reasons are abundant. So when we support our local farmers, 60 cents of every single dollar we spend are reinvested into our communities. Mm -hmm. You also are having an economic and environmental impact when you support local because you're cutting down those cross country fuel emissions. Instead of getting a product from hundreds and thousands of miles away, you're getting a product that was trucked from 30 or 20 miles in the county that you live in. Mm -hmm. You also get to know your farmer. So you get to look him or her in the eye and ask questions about why did you do this to this crop and why do you feel comfortable feeding this to your family? And then finally, it's just a downright better product. And I encourage you all to get out this weekend. If you don't believe me that it's better, put it to the test because I promise you really will enjoy the taste of local. Yeah, and there are some that are in Bessemer. There's Ross Bridge over there at Hoover. And of course, we got Moody Helena. And I know that on uh, Thursdays in Gardendale, where I live, a little bit later on, they start doing theirs. But if people want to find out where these are, tell them one more time, remind them where they can go to get all that information. Yes, sir. We make it super easy. You can visit sweetgrownalabama.org. We have a blog post that tells you where the farmers markets are located and when they're open. And you can also search for local at restaurants, grocery stores, and farm stands across the state of Alabama. I am going to take a bite out of one of those uh, strawberries during the, the, during the commercial break. You should have seen Ellie Watson just listening to the uh, weather report that uh, Jill was just talking about. You're interested in about all that rain and stuff. Thank you so much for joining us. We certainly do appreciate it. Sweet grown Alabama. Ellie Watson, thanks so much for joining us. Thank you. Okay, we got plenty more still.